Good evening, folks, and welcome to Alien Addict. Now, I do this every so so often. Um, I make a, a video where I'm, I'm, I'm set, I tell you that I'm going to change the world, this, that, and the other. I just realised when I started editing this video, I have not said thank you to Lee. Lee is the brand new Patreon on the channel. Mate, it is much appreciated, and uh, I uh, messed about with your logo a little bit just to say thank you. I've done some changes with the channel. First off, the logo. Uh, I've completely changed. Kind of, well, I say completely. It's the original design, just, in my opinion, um, improved. I did the original design at work once on a mobile phone. I just drew it my finger. Um, so yeah, I put the image into the computer and uh, I give it a boost. Yeah, I give it some, some bells and whistles. Um, there's reasons behind changing the logo as well. Um, I am going to start having some merchandise at some point because I don't want to stay in my day job. I, I The reason why I did a Patreon page to start off with because I thought, you know, may, YouTube's never going to pay uh, the money that I get from a day job to, you know, stay in this house to have curtains that don't actually, um, that are too long for the living room. Um, you know, maybe if I had more Patreons, I could afford to get curtains that fit the living room properly. And, and a working um, a kids toy book. I don't know what I don't know where that came from. There are no children in this house right now, but every so often, the toys just make noises, and it's starting to freak me out a little bit. Jokes aside, okay, yes. Everybody, may, you know, when as soon as somebody mentions a Patreon page or somebody mentions, oh, I'm going to do merchandise, it's like, this guy's just a sellout. Well, no, actually, I really enjoy doing YouTube and I'd like to do this for, for all the time. This would be the dream. So I've changed the logo because I'm going to get some mugs done. These mugs... Are going to be given out. I'm going to be giving out mugs to all my Patreons. And that's not every single Patreon in the future, because I won't be able to afford to give, uh, you know, if it, a mug to every single Patreon. Because these are going to be, I'm going to actually get China mugs uh, from China, not from China. Um, I can't say China on YouTube, um, but I'm I'm going to get some. You know, China mugs made, and I'm going to get that logo put on them. My Patreons will be getting one free um, because I really appreciate the support you've given me. Uh, future Patreons, I'll have a tier where it says, I don't know, you're going to get a free mug in in future. One second. I have no idea where that is coming from. It could be this book. Oh. There's, there's something in this book that actually scares the living bejesus out of my uh, little boy. And it's that, you know. Every time I do that to him, he has like a fit. Um, he's pulled out. Um, it looks like a planet with legs. But it's um, it's part of this book. I'm sorry, guys. I've kind of lost me 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 uh, train of thought. I probably should start this video again. But you know, sometimes these things are meant to happen um, in YouTube videos, and you're meant to have the the uh, the things go wrong. What was I saying? Yeah, the mugs. I'm gonna get some mugs made. So the lo the new logo. It, it's it's done. It's gonna go on some mugs. 
the patrons that are already patrons i'm gonna put like something out on the patreon page where i ask for your um shipping address uh and you'll be getting that free of charge as a, a little thank you from me um i might do t-shirts along the line i was waiting till i hit 10,000 subscribers which could take 10,000 years at this rate um because you kind of get this little icon in the bottom where you can you can put your t-shirts and what have you and I, I do like to draw stuff i like to create um and i was thinking you know at some point i'll get more really cool alien ideas more ideas for the channel as well this is what i need i can, i need content because i look at everybody else's content and what they're doing and everybody's doing the same stuff this is why I wanted to do the interviews. This is why I interviewed the Flat Earth, the, the Globe Denier, sorry, Rich, from 007. Um, he doesn't like being called a Flat Earther. He's a Globe Denier. Um, that went down like a lead bloom, by the way. You know? At least hear the guy out. He's quite a nice chap. I like him. But I like everybody. Um, you know, I want to get people... Of all different beliefs on this channel because I think it's interesting just to have these conversations you know a little bit like a, a Yorkshire version of uh, a, a poor man Joe Rogan that's what I'm gonna be the, the, the poor version of Joe Rogan you know the Joe Rogan that gets 300 views um, <laughs> that, that kind of thing but yeah I want to know your ideas for the channel I want if there is if you guys have any sightings, personal sightings that you've got that are not out on YouTube, or maybe you've just put it on YouTube and you've not actually got a channel, but you've put it out there and you want to get it out to a wider audience, send it to me at alienaddictuk at gmail.com. And I won't be putting any old video out. And I'm not saying it'd be rubbish. I, I, I get stuff sent all the time. Um... Recently, I had a really interesting one in a, a lightning storm, but it was just so quick that I couldn't do much with it. I'm after kind of videos that are um, very unique. I want to start putting stuff out that nobody's seen before. I want to do interviews with people who are extremely interesting, different types of people from all over the world. This is what I'm after doing. I want to grow this channel um for myself for my family and i think you know i want to grow it for you guys i want to i want to prove the people right that have stuck by me and said this channel's going to explode you know if you keep if you do more videos um it's hard to do i mean i heard um my old friend uni rock mention me on uh, one of his shows the other day now, at the same time, one of my, who I consider a friend, I'm going to consider Alien Addict a friend pretty much for life because we went through some hella crazy shit when our channels were really small. And he doesn't post all the time. But I'm here to tell you, if Alien Addict did post all the time, I truly think he would have a, lo a lot more followers. He would be like a, really, like a lot bigger of a channel. Yes, I appreciate that, Jace. Um, I will leave Unirock's channel below and his new channel. Um, he's a great content creator. Um, yes, if, if I uploaded more, I'm sure the, the, the floodgates would open and uh, we would have a load of uh, new addicts on board. But yes, what I, want, what I am after is um, growing this channel on the work that I put out now. So I, I, I can appreciate for you guys, sometimes it might be frustrating because you're like, God, when's this lazy bastard going to put a new video out? You know, it's been like seven days and I'm still waiting. I, I probably need to cut down on the edit time. Um, I put so many little Easter eggs in, my, especially the interviews that I do. I kind of like put some stuff in the background taking the mic i always put references for you guys to see a, a visual reference for to, for maybe who the guy is talking about um but yeah I, I i i do realize i need to cut that editing down because literally what, what will happen is i'll do an interview say on a wednesday in the day and then i'll start editing it that that day 
and then I'll go to work uh, on Thursday. I'll get home. I'll I'll have tea. Help Serena, my missus, put the the kids to bed. Um, then I'll start editing the video, and then the following night I'll do the same and the same, and then it might be four days later till I've actually finished editing one video. This video now, uh, I might even get this done today because it's just going to be, it's just me, isn't it? It's just like a little. I, I probably know the uh, the references that I'm already going to put in this video, the little quirks or whatever. Um, at least we've stopped old McDonald. But yeah, I, um, I I realize I kind of need to cut down the editing on the video. So if that if you start to notice maybe interviews coming out and there's not as much of the visual stuff in there, and I would like to know in the comment section below if you like really. Uh, if you're here for the the visual stuff, or if you're not too bothered about the visual stuff, if you if you like the visual stuff, I will try and uh, put in some visual stuff. Um, but I'm, I need to probably cut it down so I can get more videos out faster. It'll free me up more time to spend to do researching rather than editing because this is all I seem to do is I make a video one week and then I'm editing for I can't say edit ed, edit. Editing, editing the video for like a week. Sometimes I could be editing the week, the, editing for one freaking week, you know. Um, and it's just, it's it's draining. It is because you. I need to go to work, come home, see the kids, you know. I don't have time to game my tits off anymore. I used to love a bit of gaming. Um, but yeah, it's, it's mainly editing videos. So yeah, I, I think I need to cut down the, the time that it takes. But I need I need ideas. If you've got suggestions for people that you want me to interview, I, I get this all the time. Oh, you should interview so-and-so. If you think I should interview somebody, maybe send that person an email and say, it would be great to see you on Alien Addict. And then tell me that you've spoke to this person. I will then contact the person. See if they want to come on the show. I am a small little channel. But it is growing very slowly. I like to think that it's different from other channels this one. Um, but I want to say a massive thank you to everybody. And this is not just for the Patreons. This is to everybody who supported me along the way. Everybody who gives this... The, 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 this... I don't know what this video is, but everybody who gives the videos thumbs up, everybody, especially everybody who, who does um, tweet the videos out or tags me and stuff or sends it out on Instagram or whatever, you know, Facebook, whenever you can get this vi these videos, especially the interviews that take so long, if you can help this channel grow, then I consider, as you know, that's that's teamwork, you know. And that's what I need. I need like a, a little army of addicts that are just, you know, boom. So yeah, all the existing Patreons at the moment, uh, six Patreons, you will all be getting a mug. Um, so I, I don't know when it's going to be because I am actually getting the mugs made. Um, and I'll be getting the transfers made. You'll probably see a video of me actually putting the transfers on the mugs. Um, I may have some exclusive ones as well um, down the line. T-shirts will be coming, uh, artwork, whatever. Um, I actually have, I do have a site that, I've had a site for a long time, probably over two years now, that's not been built properly yet. Um, that may come, may come. I pay for it um, every year, but uh, I don't do anything with it. Not quite. Not quite yet. I kind of feel like I need to be more present with you guys in order to... I, my mum keeps saying to me, oh, why don't you do something with your art on your channel? You know, why don't you do these mugs? Why don't you do some t-shirts? Why don't you do some different alien designs? I'm sure people will love it because I do, I do draw. Um, I've always drawn monsters, I've always drawn aliens ever since I was a little kid. Ever since seeing the alien film, I probably, I think, I, I saw it too young, I think I saw it about, I thought, 
McDonald stopped. I actually have no idea. There is like a pile of books here. And one of these books has audio to it. But I can't work out which one it is. And I should probably, probably when I cut the video to move these little wankers around, I probably should have um, searched for it. It's kind of funny, I suppose, isn't it, that a book just keeps interrupting the video. Well, I find that kind of thing funny anyway. Um, but yeah, I do want to do stuff with my art and kind of like have a bit of uniqueness to the to the art for you so you actually when you when you do maybe buy a t-shirt it's not necessarily an alien addict t-shirt you might have i might design something you quite unique i might launch it for say a couple of weeks on that is it teespring or whatever um and then i might take it off and keep doing that get some good good designs out for you um because I want to do stuff with my artwork as well as do these videos um, and definitely keep going with the interviews. But like I say, if you want me to interview like Pacific people, uh, get, in, get in contact with them. You know, hound them if you have to say, you should go on Alien Addict, you should blah, 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 blah. You know, massive channels as well. Get them on. But yeah, keep sharing the stuff, guys. Keep putting the thumbs up. Um... If you fancy being a patron on the channel, it really does help me out. Um, in the long run, I know it will. Because YouTube, I don't know if you know this, the views that this channel gets makes peanuts. Literally peanuts. I, I, I think in one month, you, I could probably buy a packet of crisps and I could buy myself a pint with it. So what happens with that money from YouTube is it comes in. And once you've hit $60, they'll release it to you. And what I do with that money is I put it back into the channel. You know, that is what I do with it. Every bit of money that I've ever took from this channel has gone back into doing stuff with the channel. Buying equipment, buying cam new cameras. I need a new camera as well. I bought this camera thinking it was amazing because um, of the reviews. It's okay the lighting's crap you know i've got this little shitty thing here that looks like a a golf club it's like when i'm fish not you know and then fish that have the dangly thing i need to get some proper lighting i might work on getting a studio i have been thinking about converting my garage because I don't put my car in my garage. I never have. And it's just a thought about converting it. I just need to see if I can get the broadband into the garage. It's it'll be again if we can if we can do that. I say we. Um you, it, if yeah, if, if I can do that. I'll say we. You know, the support we this you know Shut One minute. I found the little bastard. Right. That's enough of that. It's quite embarrassing. But yeah. The plan is maybe to get out of the living room, get a studio, my own pad. We'll get a load of alien stuff behind us, you know. We'll have a massive poster of Homer, uh, Homer Greer, um, in his in his awe. I'd love to put that on a t-shirt. I just think I'd get some sort of uh, I'd get sued probably, um, but the the Greer meme. The, is um it's probably that i don't i don't think um I, I think i think um blake and brent would be quite proud of klingon uh blake on a t-shirt i love klingon blake but yeah guys give me your ideas 
And if anybody in the comments says, oh, this guy's just after, after, he's just like the rest of them, just after the after your money. Well, you know, yes, I, I do want to make a living out of this. That is probably every single YouTuber's, small YouTuber's dream, you know. And if they tell you otherwise, this was just a hobby. It actually was. When I had the great job, this was just a hobby. But the great job wasn't that great. It was killing me. I did a video about that ages ago as well. Whinging about my job. Whinging about the stress. I'm not stressed in this job that I'm in now at all. It's, you know, it's great. I work with a great team. Uh, good friends, all of us. Um, it's just the money's uh, wank, um, to, put it, <laughs> to put it frankly. Um, but in order to, that, that type of job, it frees your mind up to do stuff like this. And it, this is this for me is is the dream. And if you guys can help me get there, mainly by sh honestly, the best thing you can. I keep saying it. I just don't know if enough people do it. I probably don't do it enough with the the creators that I love. But that's what we need to do, especially with um, alien and UFO channels that you think are fantastic. Is share it out because YouTube just does nothing with it especially if you're new to the game or if you're under 10,000 subscribers you know it's uh it's hard it's hard work i just if if you know maybe if i uploaded four times a week i'm going to try and learn to go live properly so i can because that would be great to do as well in the long run get the get the guests on Go live with the guests so you can interact with the guests. Um, I'm going to have to learn that, how to do that. Because I'm, I'm quite, if you look at my first videos, you know, it was literally me talking, pressing record, recording a bit of the screen at the same time, putting things into place on the screen, yeah, and then pressing upload to YouTube. It was a piece of piss to do. And it looked disgusting. I like to do the editing. I, and I, the, the whole reason why these videos are black and white, by the way, is because my lighting is shite. So it makes up for it. If, if you see this in colour, it doesn't look it doesn't look amazing. And I've kind of got used to that black and white. If you want to see me in colour, let me know in the comments below if you've made it this far in the video to me rambling on. But uh, I just like to have a chat with you. I like reading the comments. I like uh, I like replying to the comments. I need to go live more, don't I? I'm just gonna have to learn it properly. Um, if you like the if you if you remember, I did some stuff ages back. Uh, it's probably gathered a lot of dust because, like I said before, I don't get time to do much gaming. But I have got a virtual reality headset for the PlayStation, where. Um, I went live a few times with that. If you enjoyed that type of live content, let me know. If you prefer it when I just talk with the camera in front of me, let me know. Tell me exactly what you want. That's, that's what I want to, I want to know, what you guys want. That's the, the bigger... It's all about you, you know? In order for this channel to survive, I need you guys to be happy. And if you're not happy, then you, you bugger off. I know sometimes you bugger off and then you come back with your tail between your legs and say, oh, I've, I've not watched your videos for a while now. That's probably because you're unsubscribed because you got a bit bored. Let's face it, we all get a little bit bored of our favourite creators sometimes or the, the creators that we find mediocre or the even the creators that we think, oh, this person's got so much potential, but you just lose interest because they're not present enough. And... I'm probably that person. I'm not present enough for you guys. I need to be more present for you. Yes, I do. So, that's the plan. Build the channel up. Slowly but surely. Eventually stepping out of the day job. And then just, woof. Just going for it. That's when we get Joe Rogan on here. I'm interviewing Joe freaking Rogan. That'll never happen. It won't happen. It could happen. You know. What did Kevin Cosner say? If you build it, he will come. 
Good night, God bless folks. I'm Alien Addict. Make sure you like, share and subscribe. Um, and yes, you're all, you're all sound as a pound. Mind the bugs, don't bite.